for having a great day today. I am going to show you step by step of how I paint this grasshopper bait for my dad for Christmas. So I hope you guys enjoy. So the first thing I did was do a good base coat of golden high flow acrylic airbrush paint. Man, that is a mouthful. But most of this will be painted with an airbrush. Um, but there is some that will be painted with a paintbrush. So first off, what I'm gonna do is once I get my good base coat of white, I will get a good solid light green base coat for the grasshopper. So this is a Christmas present for my dad for Christmas. And of course I've already given it to him by now. Um, but yeah. So now you can see I have a good base coat of green. I'll let that dry for a little bit. And then I'll come back with this color green, which I faded, um, or shaded, I mean shaded all of <laughs> um, the body that I want darker. And then I'll come back with some of this brown. I think it's sepia. Um, and then I will get some of the brown highlights on the bate. And yeah, so I just start doing a little brown around the wing area. And so I probably should have been looking at a picture while I did this. Like, so about in the middle, when I was almost done, I looked at a picture and I added a few things that kind of looks like the grasshopper. But we kind of, we made a new species. Um, so don't ask me for a picture really of the grasshopper I did. Um, I just kind of did an imaginary grasshopper. So as you can see, I'm fading the legs with a, I think the sepia. Now I'm coming back and darkening the belly of the beast. I'm still with the sepia. All these tricks I learned from Marling Bates. You should check him out his YouTube channel. And I don't know why this is so blurry. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. So now I got all my shading done and we will move on to the next thing. So as you can see, I got all my shading. Now I'm gonna come back with this red and I am going to paint under the little leggy, I mean legs to the grasshoppers. Not grasshopper, grasshopper. It's tedious work. And all you can see is my hand. Just painting away. Yeah, oh, there, there you go, that's better. So now you can see I got both legs done. And so. As you can see, I added the yellow on the legs and the black on the bate. I really couldn't record this part, I'm sorry. So as you can see, I just came back with a paintbrush and did all of the black. As you can see, I added some yellow to the, to the wings as well. And I really wanted to use this eye because it was super, super, super cool looking. But I knew my dad would not like that because he likes like baits that actually look realistic. So I went with a plain black eyeball. So, oh, and I came back with some red in the wings and a little bit of yellow. Yellow. 
As you can see, there's the black eyeball. <whistles> so, um, once I got all of that done, I put my signature on and then I was almost done. As you can see, this is the back. As always, don't forget to hit sub that subscribe button. And I learned all my tips and tricks from Marling Beach YouTube channel. You should go check him out. I love to watch his videos. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.